I was just wondering, um, just because not a lot of Republicans are focused on this, what's your concept of global warming and how you plan to solve it? Okay, what's my concept of global warming and how do I plan to solve it? I just explained to you probably about 70 or 80 percent of how I would plan to solve global warming. I would plan to solve it consistent with the energy independence agenda because I think the energy independence agenda helps to solve global warming long term. Some, almost all the things I mentioned are consistent with reducing our impact on global warming with a few exceptions. I do not believe we can cut out all reliance on oil like that. I think that first of all we can't and nobody else will. So I think we have to incrementally try to figure out how to rely less on foreign oil. And then we have to look for new methods to clean coal. This is the Fox News Radio. Uh, expanding nuclear power is probably the single most practical answer for global warming. You, you have uh, one of the people that started the Greenpeace movement that now makes that point, goes all over the world making that point. One of the, one of the disappointments in the whole way in which uh, Al Gore has analyzed this, for which he gets a lot of credit for pointing out the problem, but he doesn't spend as much time on the solution. And one of the things you wonder is, is there sort of a thing going on there with you know, nuclear power? You know, what, uh, there's, 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 there's a certain kind of um, fear that's been created about nuclear power. And nuclear power is dangerous. All forms of power are dangerous. Electricity is dangerous. Oil is dangerous. Coal is dangerous. Right? We've, lost, we've lost human life in the pursuit of all these areas of energy. Have we? Through electricity, we know about coal, right? And oil. Oil spills, oil fires, oil explosions. We've had nuclear power in this country now for over 30 years, and we haven't lost a single life. So it is potentially dangerous, but we've been able to handle it pretty well. And the way in which we handle it now is even better than the way in which we've been handling it in the past. And the French are 80% nuclear, and I didn't think the French were my party oh, What a question, what a question. Oh, I mean, Chinese we're about, right, I mean, right? I mean, they're not, they're not, they're not like, or, over, let's say, uh, over this one. Um, we wouldn't think of the French as being uh, irresponsible and in the much bigger risk takers with their health than we are, right? Ingested. So the, there are things here that there are these cross agendas that create a certain amount of husband just wants to insist on certain amount of uh, blockage the to getting this done. You really you really want to get this done. You want to get energy independence done. You want to reduce the impact on global warming. You got to throw down all the barriers and say we got to re-examine everything. And we got to get rid of the old special interest politics. And we got to look at what's in the national interest. And every one of the things that I talked about is in the national interest. I would say I think it is reasonable. Yes, obviously that we in global warming is happening. Yes, human beings are contributing to it. No, it is not a hysterical emergency that has to be dealt with as a you know, one or two year emergency or the world's going to end. It should be dealt with as a long term emergency in a sensible, mature, sound way in which we allow our economy to grow and we also allow those economies that are moving millions and millions of people out of poverty to do so. so I, it is you know, good for us, kids today, for China and India, to be moving people out of poverty. But I mean, if I have youngsters and it's good for us I, just I, as I fellow human be, beings. Be the top of my and it's good for us and for you as a young person long term. Sure you know why it's good for you that all those people are moving out of poverty in China? And of course, Aside from the, child is not just the humanitarian part of it, it's good for you you're going to have a lot more customers when you get older.